In this video I would like to show how to draw a terrain around the house and how to plan a house on a hillside. Here I have opened a house that consists of a ground floor and a basement. I now want to plan a site around it. Before you do that, you should open the layer manager and click on edit once for each floor and look here at level to see what is written here. Our upper floor has level 0, we should remember that. And our basement has the level minus 280 centimeters. We should remember this in order to create the site right away. I have already deleted the area that was there before. I will now delete a few details that are not important. Now I draw a terrain around the house in 2D mode. The ground floor is active. I click on terrain and then on terrain area and draw a property around the house. I could also measure it exactly with guides, but I'm just doing it freehand here in this example. And this is what the property looks like now around my house. In 3D mode. I'll do the terrain grid net off and see my terrain as it would look with the lawn. And now I want to tilt it. To do this, I click on terrain in 2D mode and then on elevation point and select the point in the upper left. Click in and select 2 meters as the height. Then I also make a point with a height of 2 meters in the upper right corner and click on OK. And down here on the left I make minus 2 meters and here also minus 2 meters. And already I have a terrain that has a slope. This is higher at the back and lower at the front and the house is now on a hillside. And now I would like to create elevation points around the house as well. I also click on elevation point here, click in the corner of the house and select the height zero here, so that the terrain is exactly at the bottom of the ground floor. Then I'll do the same thing here in the corner and my house is exposed from one side. I now do it on the other side as well. I'm going to click on elevation point here, zero, and here on this side I have a staircase that I want to uncover. I click here and select zero again. And now I want to uncover the stairs here, and I click again on elevation point and draw right in front of it an elevation point with minus 2.8 meters. We remember, the basement is 2 meters 80 high and I'm planning another elevation point here in the corner. And so the stairs are now exposed. And now I would also like to uncover the driveway. I do that with a Elevation polyline. Here I can now select several points in a row to which I assign a height. I choose once this corner and then the other four. And when I'm done, I press escape. Now I have four points, each of which I can assign a height to. I first press OK and select this polyline. Then I will also be shown the number of the points that I will now edit. So up here is 1, there is 2, there 3, there 4. I now go to Elevation Points and here I have point 1. I enter the height minus 2.8. Then I click on this arrow to the right. And here I now enter for the point number 2, and here I enter a 0. 
Then for height 3, I also enter 0, and for height 4 again, minus 2.8. And here I have an area which goes from the bottom to the top, and I could draw such an area with several points and give each point its own height.